Hey. <laughs> Today, while we're here, we're on Tom Clancy Ghost Recon Breakpoint. It is literally just dropped. It is officially four minutes past midnight on the 1st of October. Here we go. The game doesn't officially drop till the 4th, but you can get it early access, you know, with the extra pre orders or whatever you get it through with. Just waiting for the game to load. Here we go, syncing data. Don't know why, never played the game. I've not played the beta, so I don't know what to expect from this game. I was hoping to play the beta, but I just got home from work and thought there's no point me downloading it because the time it would take to download, there was just no time at all. Colorblind mode disabled, speaker name, yes. Subtitle background, no. Okay, I'm happy with that. Um. Regular normal enemies for most players enemies can Share mode for more advanced players enemies are more precise deadly and deadly ghost health regen will take longer to start I think it's better best to just go in regular because I've not played the beta so I've no idea how hard the actual enemies are I've just seen beta gameplay from the original beta, not the last one we've just literally had. It's something that I thought I would pick up, but then I was like, nah, I wasn't going to get this game. This was a last minute sort of, oh, I'll get this, may as well see what it's like, try it out. Get some content for the channel, because basically we're just waiting for Call of Duty. And why not have a good game? Well... As far as I'm aware, it's going to be a good game because it's a Ghost Recon game. Okay, here we go. Welcome to Aurora, the incubator of World 2.0. This is the new map of Aurora. Right you, Skell, and we've been expecting you. Ooh, they've been expecting been me. We've invited here to innovate, to invent, and to create. But we're also asking you to do the most important thing with your lives. Drones. You here. Away from the rest of the world, we will build the tools to lead the planet into the future. A completely sustainable economy, a blossoming environment, safe homes, security for your family, and a community where innovation is celebrated. The generations that come after us may forget all about us, but they will thrive because of the work we do here. Thank you for joining Scout. The hell is that? Together, we are building the world. What's going on? Because I'm assuming people have seen this on the beta, but I've only seen actual gameplay. Right, the USS C CA has a mysterious, mysteriously sunk in near Aurora, home of Scale Tech. Unable to establish contact with it, we're going after it. Okay, so it looks like we've got some sort of big tactical team force going out. We're all Ghost Recon members. Okay, that's four helicopters. Five or six people in each one. Let's say there was ten. That'd be forty, so there's probably less than that. Say about 25, 30 members between each. Right, oh, okay. Customised appearance. Okay, so it's female, that's the male. Okay, face. My right, first thing I want to do is non. And facial hair, non. Just so I can actually see my characters. Full face, right. 
Okay, what am I going for? Generic actually looks probably the best, if I'm honest. Oh, Leon. Hmm. About Paul. Yeah, we'll go Paul, I think. I don't think we can change it either, so. Right, I call her blue. Her. Hmm. I think we should go for like a military cut. <coughs> Sorry about that. Yeah, I don't want to go for a mohawk. Hmm. Oh, I'll go back. Yeah, let's go for that. Why not? Do we really want a beard? I don't know. Is the one with a bit of stubble? No, there isn't. You might unlock more as you go on. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. On that black. Okay, don't want any facial scars. For now. And that's it. Start with this appearance. Oh, what was that? Are we being shot? <coughs> Is that are they birds? Is that a like a flock of birds? Boom. I guess maybe we'll find out what that is later. Because right now we're in a crash. I feel like we're upside down because the flames are going up, aren't they? Well, actually, they're going down. If you think about it. <clears throat> okay, that's really weird. What the hell is that? Are they like wasps? What the hell? Yep, that answers my question. We're upside down. I think he's dead. I don't think he's sleeping. Right, this is to the point where I start seeing gameplay. So I've not seen anything before it, and I've seen bits of it after this. But I haven't seen gameplay since not this beta that we've just had, because obviously it's only just finished yesterday. I've not seen any gameplay. I've seen gameplay from the beta before the one we've just had. So I don't know if the things have changed or anything like that. I don't know. I'm assuming it's pretty much the same thing. And I don't know what's really to come, so this will be quite interesting. And it's better that I haven't played the beta, because the missions will be not new. Well, no, they will be new, and they won't be as boring or repetitive that I've just completed the beta. Right, can we heal ourselves? I know that's a thing that's in the new game. You have to actually look after yourself in this. Right, we have a severe injury, it says at the bottom. And we've taken our friend's hand on. Everyone else is dead. Right, so this game is more of a tactically stealth game than the last one. If you want to go guns blazing in the last one, that was fine. But if you do that in this one now... You're more likely to get killed. Purely because you've got things like this now. Where you can go pro camo. And cover yourself in dirt. Purely because you'll have things like drones. And enemies that are actually. Ex. Well I was about to say military. But they're ex special forces. They're ex ghost members some of them. And the leader is like your best mate. That you can actually get a mission with. 
But it's kind of weird that I only noticed the other day on the normal, well, not the normal, the first Ghost Recon Wildlands. Okay, whoa. No god prone. Camo up. Okay, that's one. There's a guy literally there, but I can't get him. Now I can get him. Right, that's two targets. Right, I'm thinking I could take them out, but take him first, because he'll see him go down. But, can I do it like a, a stealth takedown? I want to test that. Right, so it's the right thumbstick button. Right, so we need to be a little bit quicker than that, than that next time. Right, and then we need to carry the bodies because it's all about hiding now because if a drone flies over. I'm assuming they pick up the bodies, I think, I believe. Right. And there's a helicopter there. There's some enemies over there, but I think we can bypass them pretty much. Right, so you can't run with the body. Right, let's put this guy in the bush. Drop him there. Let's get this guy. Let's take him in the building. Okay, let's just chuck him down there. How's a ghost member got in here? That's a bit weird. What's this here? These grenades? Right, so I've got frag grenades, some extra bullets. Okay, things are going well. Hold RB. Oh, we got a wheel. Oh, we got a wheel. Okay, so we want bandages for now. Because we don't want to accidentally press any of the buttons. Right, there's a crate there. Hope there's no snipers up there. That's a perfect sniper position to camp up with a ghillie suit. You probably wouldn't even need a ghillie suit. Now I think this, if I'm not wrong, there you go, is going to be an assault rifle for us. Okay, okay, this is a bit weird. Oh, whoa. Um... Okay. Have we got a hat? Can we get a hat? No, right. So you can pick up the enemy's outfits, I believe. I'm not 100% sure on that. Don't take my word for it, but I believe you can. Now, edit in the gunsmith. Okay, so we need to equip more things to it. Right, okay. Right, let's go that. Take suppressor off. Suppressor on. I don't know what the AB thing is. My soldiers. Oh, it's that. Okay, that's better. Right. Let's have a look at his soldiers. Well, unfortunately, he is dead. Just the way the guy's walking in this one is more tactically. And the way he runs, it's more realistic than military and crouching. In the last one, it wasn't as tactically... It didn't feel as tactical. 
this one feels like I'm going to need to concentrate more and probably team up with a few friends. Not that any of them will have this probably because they're all saving up for Call of Duty. Okay, so there's a group of people over here. Okay, one, two. Now they're facing directly me. So I want to camo up if I can. And I want to run behind them. Just be careful he doesn't spot me. Either of them actually. Surely they'd be like a little path in. Right, that looks to be a path in, but we'll take the dirt road on. Right, we're getting exhausted. Okay, let's take our time. I don't want to be the guy that misses a survivor and gets us in trouble. They must be dead. Ain't no way anyone can live through all this. This place is huge! Why we've we never heard about it before? I don't want to take a shot and alert everyone, that's my issue. Perfect. You couldn't have asked for two better shots then. Right, we'll move the bodies in seconds. Right. By the way, he, gra he also grabs the most sensible thing. He picks up the. Uh, I'll, I'll show you again. He picks up like the gun holster. That's what he uses as his lift. Just drop him there. Right. I don't know the map, so this is going to be a lot more fun and interesting. And I'm glad that they just created a map instead of making a real place. Because with the fake place, they can make the map bigger and with different terrains, things like that. And obviously the woodlands is something I really like. I prefer the woodland warfare over all of them. Desert warfare is kind of fun, but with the woodland, you can sort of go to ground like I'm able to with the camera. Right, there is a chest in there that I would like to get then, so that's one guy, two guy, any more, I feel like there's some within that base, right take it easy, take cover behind the tree, okay we're just going to slowly move up, Okay, it looks like we're no way that safe right now. Hey, remember what Blake said. This is a hundred percent accountability, all right? Get down. Uh, body arm, body arm, body armor. Don't want to put any tattoos on. Okay, earpiece is the best one for that, backpack will leave, tops, oh, proper ghillie suits I think, oh yes, like the last one they were a bit weird, but the, these are going to be good I think. Right, let's just leave with what we got for now, face mask. No, we'll go with that for now.
I have some body armor, that's what I need. Vest. Ah. No one walks away from this alive. Right. Okay, so it looks like there's more. And I don't really want to take them on. Unless I really have to. What a mess. No one can survive those crashes. Whatever, Cherry. You know what? No, you know what? We're gonna forget that. I'm not going after them. Remember, stealth is key, and there's no need to attract attention if we don't need it. Because I'm sure we're going to come across more people later on. Okay, so apparently this is a testing site. Because there was a big metal thing over there before, and that wasn't a helicopter. Is anyone here? I'm sure we're going to come across more people later on. Okay, so apparently this is a testing site. Because there was a big metal so thing funny. over there before, and that wasn't a helicopter. Is anyone here? I'm sure we're going to come across more people later on. Okay, so apparently this is a testing site. Because there was a big metal so thing over there before, and that wasn't a helicopter. We'll just ignore that. But Weave is the guy that you can... Hundred Level 150. Okay, so dangerous and very... Okay, so they have different markers. Okay. What the hell are you doing? I think it's probably best just to leave. But yeah, Walker is the guy that you can play with on a few of the missions. If I can get gameplay in that for you, I will. Right, because they're behind me, I don't want them to just start tracking me, so we're going to have to move quick. But we've got to take people out while we're moving. I'll be goddamn amazed if we find anyone alive. Nice, keep moving. So a look at the new skills. Okay, so the skill menu allows you to specialize. Okay, so we can pick one. Okay, right, so what's Panther? Panther unlocks a spraying thing. Shark Shooper Shark Shooper? Sharp shooter. Uh, sensor launcher, armor, armor buster, high penetration bullets with bonus damage. What's assault? Recoil reduction, extended duration, healing drum. Can you be honest? It's either assault or sharpshooter.
Okay, I think I'm going to go with the salt. That's the one I've gone for anyway. What's that? Okay, deploy parachute, we can't get yet. Can't get that yet. Can't get that. Them two are the main priorities. What's that? That's a good one to have, and obviously that one is. Right. Men down, or repeat they are down. Okay, so we just got some new boots, that's nice. Right. Oh, there's quite a lot there. Right, they're running out that way, so they're going to find the bodies. In fact, they've set, they've set up a defensive position. One crouches, one stands. I was going to shoot, but then as I pressed, I thought better not. Right, they're coming back down this way? No. <laughs> okay, so it looks to be going around that swamp to either side. I think we might have it. Right. What's in here? Oh, sniper. Do love a good sniper. What's this? Are we going to be using a radio that's still working, maybe? Mayday. Mayday. The ghost lead. Does anyone read? Five by five, ghost lead. Who is this? A friend. I got the radio from a ghost. This ghost still breathing. Ghost lead. You can chase the white rabbit. Or run with the Red Queen. Give me a sit rep. I can wait. Your man's getting medical treatment. Follow the trail behind the ancient ruins. Your destination is in the mountains between two waterfalls. Understood. Ghost lead out. Okay, we're about to get some serious help. But we need to get there first. Get down. I don't know what's on them trains, I don't know whether they've got snipers, whatever. Doesn't look like the train does have anything on them. Right, let's get out of here because they're going to be hot onto them bodies that have, uh, well, that I've placed there. Okay, so there's quite a lot of people around here. We're going to go the opposite way, though. I could take them out, but again, what's the point? I haven't got a full squad yet. There is a vehicle with a gun, but that's too close and exposed. We're just getting in this. Go, 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 go. 
Drive. I wonder whether the vehicle mechanics have changed. They don't feel as slidey. Feel quite. They still feel quite weird. Although Ubisoft made the drive San Francisco series. No, 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 get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Right, there's a crate here. Apparently, you want to find the watering can, but they're not easy to find. But that's something we want to find. Right, let's change into this then. Test it out. It's tempting us so bad. And that's where we want to go. No, no, it's not. That's where we want to go. No. Change seat. No, where we go. Okay, this vehicle sounds nice. And away we go. And I don't know what that sound effect was that I just made. Sounds nothing like this vehicle. Sounds like a beast. Okay, there's quite a lot of vehicles dotted around. That's kind of good for us. I don't know if it's just because the first mission sort of thing. Just trying to get you to see all the different vehicles. Right, here comes another enemy area. No, no, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Keep going. I'm assuming that if you well, I don't think it will because it's just a game. But if you were hot on the trail and then just found someone and they were driving this way, you would just follow the trail, wouldn't you? So it's sure it's not going to be long until we're going to have to move base. If this is a base, anyway. Ah, it's very hidden. Hidden within the rocks. Um. Oh, that's cool. They've got like camo leaves down it, so Stop you can't right even there. see it. Ghost. I was invited. Who the hell are you? Another one. You can always turn around and go back down the mountain. Things are a little tense, you know. Just watch how you handle that weapon. We don't allow shooting in Erewhon. We got a lot of shooting going on. A cave, so we call it. Get in. I don't trust her. She just went, get in the cave. And then gave you that log in. She's going to turn around and shoot us. I think she's the main bad guy. Plot twist. Okay, so that's an online play. Apparently, the Muslim did. Okay, very nice uh, thing. Right. Okay, so we can't accept get our weapons out here. What is this place? It is like the division, actually. <laughs> Just a massive base in an area you don't expect it, like on the rooftops. Yeah, this is basically like the division. It's a 
area where online players go to meet up, but also to do main missions and to get main missions. It's pretty cool. Are you boys all right or what? We're the only two left in our chalk. No radio, no drones. Between the two of us, we got two rifles and eight mags. Locals got water here. And some supplies. Can you believe this place, man? God damn. It's amazing. The mind's blown. Yep. And they're friendly, more or less, but they're still keeping us on a short leash. You boys know what took out our birds? No clue. But there are definitely hostiles out there. Tango with some troops out there who were calling themselves wolves. You know who we're dealing with? Now you're dealing with me. Oh, who's this guy? You the one Sheriff in charge of the town? Who's asking? My call sign's Nomad. I'm the officer in charge of this operation. By operation, I assume you mean the massively wild screw up. Hey, old man. You playing nice? Let's try to find out why a bunch of grunts are falling from the sky into our laps, honey. Well, someone sank a naval cargo ship off the coast. Then the entire archipelago of Aro went dark. Now, we were sent here to figure out what happened. Operation. By operation, I assume you mean the massively wild screw-up. Hey, old man. You playing nice? Let's try to find out why a bunch of grunts are falling from the sky into our laps, honey. Well, someone sank a naval cargo ship off the coast. Then the entire archipelago of Aro went dark. Now, we were sent here to figure out what happened. Operation. By operation, I assume you mean the massively wild screw-up. Hey, old man. You playing nice? Let's try to find out why a bunch of grunts are falling from the sky into our laps, honey. Well, someone sank a naval cargo His drones are keeping an eye on his islands. So you think he's still a part of this? We're just not sure why. All right. Well, I'll put figuring it out on my to-do list. Okay. For now, I see our wounded. Yeah. One of your guys is like that. He won't shut up. Calm him down, yeah? And then come find me. I'll give you the guided tour. Okay. In the old days, you could hear and smell factories. Okay, so I can see people very kitted out. Like, very well kitted out. So I don't know if that's people have been on it. Well, the game in the UK has only been out for 42 minutes, but... I don't know whether that's obviously people in other countries just got it before us, like a day before us, but... Whether the betas allow people to carry on. Also, I don't really know. Nomad. Who's left? Who made it? Dunno. We really don't know. Relax, pal. I'm doing what I can. You damn superhero. Yes. Da -da -da. Here. Here's another superpower. I can't find Midas. But Weaver... He's dead. He was the guy that was next to us, I think. He just relaxed, pal. We'll take care of him. And the Weaver was the guy that got shot. And the Wasp. Yeah. And with the comms blackout, I can't reach the ship. But I'll talk to Mad Shells, the big guy. You might have a boat I can use. Don't you worry. I'll come back with some help. Go.
Well, we know that's not gonna happen unless it'd be game over in seconds. Okay, so we got a watering canteen, so we don't need one then. Bit weird. Right. Looks like there's a little X crossover, that one. Can we jump over things in here? Okay, I don't want the whole tour of this. That's for another day. Go away. No, they can jump over that. No, go away. I don't want your... Yeah. This is the thing when you load up a new game. You get all the millions of different things. That I just want to learn myself. I don't want a tutorial on how to move through a menu. I prefer just finding it myself. Right, is this the woman? No, that's the woman. She's the woman giving us the tour. No need to be afraid. Yeah. Couldn't help but over here. There's some kind of problem. We're not sure. Our friend Samuel's missing. You a homesteader? Yeah, used to be. Okay, that's not the person we're after. I think this is the person we're after them. How's your pal? Holding up. Thanks for looking after him. You heard anything about a Lieutenant Colonel Walker? That the guy that works with the troops call themselves the Wolves? He used to be Skeltech's military advisor. Heard he was an operator. You know him? <sighs> yeah. Your best mate? We met a couple times. Not a few times, like best mate middle oh now we're going back in time. Here we go, Middle East. See what I mean, best mate? That's no mad. He's saving you, you're saving him. You're under contact fire. Okay, she's pulled that assault rifle from somewhere, I'm not really sure where. So I've seen me listening to headphones too long because I didn't see a flashbang go off. You got a mean look in your eye. You got big plans? Um. You know how I can get off this island? Right. And leave us regular folk to fend for ourselves, huh? Auckland is 2,000 kilometers away. It's an awful long way to run with your tail between your legs. I'm not running, Mads. The USS Wasp is a couple dozen clicks off the coast. If I can get there, I can come back here with some help. The Wasp, huh? Not sure I'm fond of the idea of a bunch of squids running around our island. Well, there are a couple of jarheads on board, too. Well, if that's the case... I think he was being sarcastic there. Look. I'll be straight with you. We know that we're no match for former spec ops. So some of our friends, homesteaders and Skell employees both, are leaving the island on a couple of boats. Can you get them protection on the Wasp? Absolutely. All right, I'll tell you where the boats are. Oh yeah, maybe the game is gonna end in a few seconds. Okay, tell me where the boats are. going. It's very confusing. Ah. Okay, there we go. 
Yeah, so now we need to get out. Also, uh, it's, the, it's that time again. Now, Mike, uh, Can you get out this way? Okay. Yeah, I doubt it. You'll have to probably go up all the way around. We'll be back when we get out of here. Before my death. Okay guys, out we go. There's a helicopter there. First chance we get, we get in the helicopter. Check out the flying mode. Well, not the flying mode, just the actual overall flying. Pretty much like the last one. Feels a little bit faster, actually. In fact, a lot faster. Uh, is that a tornado? A water sprinkler? Don't really know what that is. Guess I'll find out. This map is massive. All of that and whatever's on the other side of that. That's a big base down there, so we'll keep away from that. This video will be probably about an hour and a half long, maybe. I don't know. We'll see how long it actually goes for but basically I'm just trying to do one main video where we get a lot of the tutorial stuff done with and stuff like that and get a first main mission done and then we'll end it there and then I'll do another one where it's like 20 minutes no longer hopefully depending on how long the missions actually are Okay, we're at the boats. Not gonna hurt anyone. Mad Schultz sent me. You don't look like homesteaders. Well, I worked. I work uh, for Skeltech. Mads is a friend. When Sentinel started arresting people, he helped us out. Why did he send you? My chopper got to this island from a Navy ship just a few dozen clicks off this coast. I can get these bolts back to that ship, then I can come back here with help. <laughs> well. <laughs> Certainly sounds better than taking a boat all the way to Auckland. <laughs> what happened to your chopper? I'm still working that out. You leave it someplace? <laughs> yeah. Maurice Fox. And this is my daughter, Harmony. Why do I feel like she's going to be a main character? Call me going to have to protect it at some point. We met another soldier. He said his name was, um, Hill. Josiah Hill? Is he here? No, uh, he helped us get around some of Sentinel's men, but he was injured. Well, I mean, not, not, not badly. We left him at this uh, fishing building area thing. I actually think I know what you're talking about. I'll pick him up after I get back. Shit. More bad guys. 
Everyone take cover. Okay, so I'm in this building. Oh, is that a scar? Well, I'm run past. They just don't have a clue. They get back down. Let them all go onto that pier. Why is my guy stuck? What the hell? I'm stuck. My, my character is glitched already. And I've been playing the game, what? Five minutes? Ten minutes? Okay, there we go. Out here somewhere. That's one down. Let's <laughs> see, they're all scrambled, they haven't got a clue where to go. They don't know what to do. See, this is this is working perfectly. This none of them have made an actual sighting of me. None of them have gone. Oh, he's over there. So they don't exactly know where I am yet. Oh, he may be. If he may have reported me, I don't know then. Because he definitely saw me and spotted me. But whether he told the others, because they don't seem to be putting contact fire on me. Come on, come out of cover. That's it, come out of cover. Okay, done. Right, class tutorial. Okay, so that's that. So you click on that. Okay, right. These two are okay, and they're the main priority. What the hell was that? Give me a minute. My God. Those people. There's no way off this island then. It, it must be a, 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 a new security programmer. Holy flying cow. My guess is, my guess is nothing could come to or leave this island as long as it's on. That must be what brought down my chopper. I want to go home. Me too, kiddo. Listen, you have to get these people, and you have to get out of here. What? No one is coming to save you, and there's no ambulance on the way. You have to run. You have to get to Air One. Okay, yes, yeah. Are you coming with us? I'm gonna find I'm my gonna friend. get my guy. That fishing building you left him at was a fallback point. There may be other soldiers. Good luck. All right. I guess we're going back into the thickness of the uh, woodland that we originally came from, I think. Oh, the way he just holds his gun like that.
Right, let's go and get our guy. Okay, so we need to go and find, is it Jonas or Jonah Hill? I don't know. I guess we'll find that again in a minute. Okay, let's avoid this patrol. Let's avoid that patrol. The back of the main road. Okay, we're going right through an enemy base. Contact front, contact left, contact behind. LBRB True Grip Technique. I don't understand what that is, but okay. And there's people right behind us. I think we lost the trail of them, but we're about to get another trail probably the minute we go past here. Down there. I'm thinking the best thing to do is take a vehicle to him because then you can put him in the vehicle if he's injured because I'm assuming it's going to show us the carrying mechanic of the teammate. Right, hide the vehicle behind the back. What's in this trunk? Oh! Very heavily armoured thing. Right, let's go into this door. Hey, hey brother. White Rabbit. Nomad? Josiah. Josiah. Holy shit. Nice to see you're still above ground. Anyone else from your chalk? A few. I take it chalk means team or helicopter. One or the other. Man. We sure screwed the pooch on this one.
He needs to get back to that base. <coughs> That's the first stage. Josiah. I saw Walker out there. Hunting down our soldiers. You saw who? Lieutenant Colonel Walker. Cole Walker. Here. Fighting our guys? There's no way. It's what I saw. I can't believe it. He's one guy I admired, you know? Okay, so we get to choose what we want to say. That's good. So what's your lay of the land? Uh. Not very good. You think Walker suggest. sank that cargo ship? Or someone he was working with did? Look. What are we about to watch? Okay, so we're pretty much working an investigation. Jay Skell sunk that cargo ship. Damn. Everything that happens here is because of that prick. I'll locate Jay Skell. I met some Skell Tech employees. I'll see what they know. I'll try and round up more survivors. We'll link up at RP Delta. Sounds good. Who's the team leader at this point? Because shouldn't I be the one telling him what to do? Okay. Right, talk to whatever his name is. Right, let's get back to this base. I've got a vehicle here that's good, so we'll use that. Okay guys, so we are back at base, and all I'm going to do is end this video here now, because I've been recording for just over an hour, so I don't want to do the next mission until the next video, because it's literally talk to the guy and get some information. So we will join back in the next video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, press the notification button down below for instant notifications. I hope you've enjoyed this video, because I'm liking this game so far, and we've only done an hour, and most of it has been like getting used to the game, bit of tutorial. And that's about it, so I'm hoping to get more tactically, tactically involved, hopefully get a few mates on, and see what we can do. So I'll see you guys in the next video.